It doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? And we're with you every step of the way. Live coverage here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Iran, and they take on Saudi Arabia. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. And a look at the lineup for Iran. Well, in this 4 4 2, the second forward has two jobs. Firstly, to find space behind the opposition's midfield, and secondly, to help out his central players when they haven't got the ball. He'll certainly be key today. And a look at the starting lineup for Saudi Arabia. Well, I'm just a little worried. They might be too negative here. They're certainly going to be hard to break down with that five man midfield. But will they have enough going the other way? I'm not sure. And now they get the ball rolling. Well closed down straight away. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the keeper able to hold on to it. Well, the chance has been missed. No other way to describe it. Ali Al Hassan. Well, no stopping him. Opportunity! And it's in! We've just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final. One to Sabre. Well, here it is again, and that's the perfect volley, isn't it? He strikes it so well. What an excellent finish. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. An important interception.
Well, he's lost the ball. Nuro Rahi. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. The end product just wasn't there. But attacking possibilities. The cross is on. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Real chance. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Showing good defensive judgment. And he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Polisade. And he was in the right place to intercept. Now, who can he play it to? doing his job getting the touch and the referee has given the corner so maybe scope here for them to add to their lead well the danger is still there Ejan Hajisafi Sardar Osmoon it looks promising well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Determined defending. And he takes on the shot. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and their dream remains very much alive. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Sardar Osmo gives it a go. Oh, he's blocked it. Al Hassan Saud Abdul Hamid. Intelligent threaded pass here. Routine, really. Mehdi Tarami. Haj Safi. Now able to close down the short. Al Shekhri breaking at pace. And he read it well defensively. And space to exploit, maybe. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance.
The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Salem Aldoseri. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Still not clear. And I think the threat has been averted. Osmoon. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Al Bulaihi. Al Hassan. Can he take advantage? And the keeper diving to thwart him. And he's fired over the corner. It might still be problematic. That is that for the first half here. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Could be! And a really good diving stop. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, nearly shaving the post with that header. For more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. It's going to take a while to see how bad this injury is because he got trodden on in that last challenge. So his foot is definitely a bit sore. Cheers, Jeff. This could be the equaliser. Oh, but he's missed it. He's completely failed the test. Well, that was a big opportunity and they really should be level now. They have to be more clinical in front of goal. They've given it away. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And Sarifard. Now with Toremi. Can he get them level? Well, a cheeky attempt, but narrowly off target. So unlucky. Abdul Hamid Saleh Al Shekhvi Opportunity Well what a start that was Nuro Rahi Karim and Sarifar How can he take them on and beat them But they dealt with the threat first Abdul Hamid Al Shekhri and a strong tackle so a half an hour remaining and he's through here oh a goal it is the equaliser in this final what next in the drama Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Goal! And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Control a big part of his game. 
Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Ejan Hajisafi. And continues his run. Can he finish? What a save. Over it comes. It's still alive. Oh, chance taken. There is opportunism for you. But a disappointed goalkeeper. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. Well, back on the way, and a glut of goals here. 3-2. Hatan Bahebri, perfect challenge. Al Abed. Now, who can he play it to? And a chance to level it. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Corner kick played in. And you don't want to lose possession there. And he's in an offside position. And a shot from some way out. A routine save. Milad Mohamedi. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Must score! Able to close down the shot. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Chances on. And lining it up. Can they slot it home? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Ejan Hajisafi. Is a Tolahi. And still pressing. Determined block. Ten minutes left for play. Bahebri. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. And the counter looks on here, options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. a very disappointing attempt well the keeper can't believe his luck that's a really poor effort Karim and Sarifar well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened can he finish them off great defending here constantly thwarted if they can score again from this corner it probably would be the end of the story and they're making a change. Polisade. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Nawaf Al Abed. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. And the referee blows for full time. They've only gone and won the World Cup. And what a performance. Not just today, but throughout the tournament. They've been absolutely brilliant. Hats off to them.
the world champions. They put so much into this tournament, and now they have their reward, Stuart. You're absolutely right. They've been spirited, they've been hard-working, they've been well-organised. They thoroughly deserve to win this trophy.